Oh, all right, week three, third time's a charm. Round three out of oh, third, three, three puns. Oh god. Hello wrestling fans and welcome to another edition of the Supla's WWE 13 Attitude Era Let's Play. My name is Nono Akimbo and for week three we will jump right into this. We are going to continue the Rise of DX story. We are seven twelfths of the way through. Uh, Hunter Hearst Helmsley versus Bret Hart is our next match in Kansas City, Missouri. WWF is still losing in the ratings. To Nitro, not good. Unless you're a WCW fan. Complete all historical bonuses. Lure Bulldog into distracting the ref by pinning... What? Well, Bulldog is distracting the ref. I... What? Irish whip Brett out of the ring towards the announce table. Uh-huh. Oh, I see. Okay. All right. Simple enough. Oh, man, oh, man. Hunter, here's Tomsley. You are a card. You are a character. You're dumb. Triple Well, oh well. So, that's cool. He got called Triple H. Huh. History. Brett! There you are. the champ he's the best in the world in the 90s what a matchup this is going to be as hunter first Hillsley faces Brett Hitman Hart the WWE champion yeah yeah Yeah! <laughs> well, he's like a mix between uh, CM Punk and Daniel Bryan. Yes! Alright, yeah. Yeah, I know that. Okay. Oh, oh no, Brett, you in trouble. Oh, that's not a noise. Nope, didn't mean to throw you that direction. Let's just do that again. What was that supposed to be? Not ten years ago, no. Today. All right, cool. I know what day it is too, Lawler. Oh, ooh, yes. As far as wrestling goes, I wish it was ten years ago, but not the case. No, we are in fact in the year 2012, where. People like Ryback are constantly in the main event, which is a waste of time because we know he's never going to win. What? 
That is how the world works. In Vince McMahon's head. Ooh, kick in the gut. Ooh, knee. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> ooh, do, do, knee. And close my. Now I'm going to punch you in the face, Brett. Get ready for it. Get ready for it. It's already happening, Brett. Nothing you can do about it when it's already happening, Brett. Oh, God. Oh, oh, reverse. Reverse. Uh, oh, yeah. Ooh. I wish there was a commentator that just did that. Just made noises. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. And then you gotta have like the other guy translate for him. Yeah, that was pretty cool, wasn't it? Ah! Oh my gosh. Suplex over the ropes. I don't know what that was supposed to be, but thank you for listening. Oh, this is taking a long time. Oh, boom! He's not even at light damage yet. Nope. No, he's not. <gasps> Pile driver. Yes. Yes, indeed. Oh, where's my cup? Oh, I don't have my cup. For a uh, Bane impression. I'll show you guys uh, next week, but there's there's a way to do uh, an impression of Dark Knight Rises Bane just using an everyday plastic cup. It's pretty entertaining once you uh, get the hang of it. Yeah. Oh, come on. There you go. Pedigree! Why did the camera go all wonky? There you go, little dust. Uh. Got it! Boom! Count him out! Count him out! Oh, nine! Ten! Yes! That was sweet. How's he lifting him? That's a big guy. And Sean is not. I like the British Bulldog! Oh, fun! Bret Hart and Shawn Michaels were polar opposites. From the beginning, the groundwork was laid for a fierce rivalry. I just want to say one thing, Shawn Michaels, I can promise you for 60 minutes, you were in for the absolute worst pounding of your entire life. The historic Iron Man match did nothing to settle their issues. In fact, it only fueled the fire. Just because I choose to live my life openly and freely does not make you a better man. As the taunting unfolded, their bitter feelings intensified. You're nothing but a degenerate. You're the most arrogant, pompous guy I've ever seen. I thought I could do it. You're way out to me now. You'd like to hit me, but you, you don't have the insights to do it. This here is what it's all about. And until you have this, you will never, ever, ever be the showstopper. Red Heart, you are a zero, my hero. I'm gonna kick your little scrawny ass. A story full of twists and turns saw Bret Hart's contract negotiations become the focal point of what would become their final encounter. Everybody just keeps turning a blind eye. You keep turning a blind eye. Everybody in that dressing room knows that I'm the best there is, the best there was, and the best there ever will be. I don't think there's ever been a rivalry that has been talked about as much worldwide as this issue between Bret Hart and Shawn Michaels. 
And the smart money is, is that you will never, ever see it again. Damn. Learning is fun. Although I kind of knew everything that time. I didn't know that their Iron Man match was at WrestleMania, though. I knew they had one, and I knew they fought at WrestleMania, but I didn't know it was at the same time. This is that. Well. Win by pinfall or submission. Hidden object? What? I, what? Would you? I, it's the. What? It's the only one. What do you. What? What, what am I. Okay. Alright then. I don't know what uh, okay. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? Oh, he became a double champion? I didn't know he was European champion when this happened. That's how that works? I didn't know. Thank you, Lala, clearing that up for me. For the championship, for the belt. No, no, no. Let's do this. It's an Truly objective. What the frick is that supposed to be? The best. It's all about the power, Ross. Bret Hart wants to damage the goods of Shawn Michaels. Oh boy. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, I'm the best. I'm the best in the world! Okay. Oh, it's tense. Oh, it's tense. Ow. So tense. Oh yes. What? I reverse that. What's the oh, it's Vince. Doing out here? Well, how should I know? Is this company, though? I'm sure he just wants to see that this match 
doesn't end through disqualification. Nice. Vince is here. Vince, what are you doing? Are you my hidden objective? Oh, did you see the next snap back? If I actually knew how this event in history went down, I might know what to do. This is actually one of the major things in wrestling history that I don't entirely know how it happens. I know the end result, but that's about it. I don't know how it gets from point A to point B. Oh boy. Uh, oh, yes. Uh, nope. Alright. Alright. I didn't want to reverse it anyway. Uh, nope. Damn right I did. Oh, bam. Okay, yeah, I actually kind of wanted to do a drop kick. Nope. Alright, cool. See if I care. See if I care. Because I don't. That's a lie, I do. I care tremendously. Oh, man. Yes. No? Alright. So yes? No? Gone. Okay. Maybe. Maybe someday. I remember when I did moves. It was fun. Okay. Do a move. And Thank you. The body slam. Whoa. Boom. Oh, there you go. That was so great. It was so great, wasn't it, Roller? Sean got off that elbow drop. Oh, bam. Okay. I don't know how I missed that. Neck blocker. Yeah, I just broke his neck. It's over. He's dead. Now I want it. Okay. Yeah, I'll just miss everything. Yep. Yep. Oh boy. Come on, Brett. Don't be like this, dude. Oh man, I thought we were friends, dude. Come on, man. Brett, don't be like that, dude. Uh oh. Oh no. Man, I love, I love Canadians. I love them so much I refuse to say their name right. Oh, what? What? Are you, he, 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 he twitched. <laughs> He's like, I, I uh, one. What? Oh, okay, one second. That suplex was so powerful it knocked the freaking capture out of focus. Oh man. Oh yeah. No, 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 no problem. I didn't want to. Like do a move or anything. He's really going for it now. Uh, uh. Uh. Ben, Ben. Man, take longer, why don't you? That was fast. <laughs> he was like, I, I want to. Uh. Oh, boom! Oh, bam! Bam! What is that? 
perform the sweet the, the boom what as the stronger man he has to bring his power into this one now he sees it look out classic Sean Michaels so I gotta do this sharpshooter to Brett and it'll be my signature all right I'll just taunt for days. Figure! Figure sharpshooter for! Does this count? Oh no. Uh oh, I'm still taunting, no! No, I don't do that, Brett, man. I thought, Brett, man, I thought we were cool, man. Brett, man, the hit man. I thought we were cool, man. Don't do me like that, Brett. I wouldn't do you like that. Or would I? No! Brett, you're a jerk. Oh, Brett. I feel like this is like a sitcom. Like Brett shows on Jingle. Jingle. No, no! I don't think I was in any danger that time. Bam! DX Chap! <gasps> Boom! DX cross. Ooh, yes. Bam. Let's um, please get a signature sometime today. That would be awesome. No? All right, cool. I'll just punch you in the stomach. There you go. No, get down. Get down, get down. No, 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 no. I have my... No! Don't step on my elbow. No, ho, ho, I swear to God. Don't. Don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. No, I hate you. Oh. Okay, it said signature. There you go. Ring the bell. Ooh, he spit in Vince's face. Sean doesn't look happy. What is he doing? <laughs> I'm making circles of my fingers, Vince. That's how mad you made me. Oh, I unlocked Bret Hart, Vince with a suit, and a bonus match. Sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. So that's the Montreal screw job. Fun. Hit Mankind with the steel steps. Kane, why am I Kane? Put Mankind through the announce table and land a tombstone pile driver win by t pinfall. Tinfall. Um, I'm assuming tombstone's my secondary finisher. Yes. I don't know what this match has to do with anything. <laughs> Is this a bonus match? Yes? No? Alright. Maybe so? 
Well, at least I get to be Kane. That's cool, right? Whoa. Yeah, stop being red, buddy. Stop doing that. that I don't want Sin Cara lights, buddy. Dude, it's Paul Bear! Dude, it's Paul Bear! I didn't know Paul Bear was in this game. Uh oh. Really? Man? Mark Nut! I'll, oh, sh I forgot to shut my phone volume off. I'll do that after this match. Ooh. Bam! I just realized mask versus mask. Does the loser have to take off their mask? No, stay there, Paul. Aw, oh, man. Bang! Yo, it's me. It's me. It's Kane. Okay, this red is obnoxious. Why is it doing this? I don't remember a time in history where Kane would frickin' be like Sin Cara. Oh, ooh, yes. I don't know. Did this actually happen, or is the game like glitching out on me? Oh, yes. Thrust into your pelvis. That sounded a lot less weird in my head. What an impact from that kick! Snapmare into a blah blah blah. <laughs> That's what that move's called, a blah blah blah. Sweet. What's he up to here? Whoa, watch out! Get rid of these table parts. I hate table parts. Come on, Mick Foley. I'm gonna put you through this table. Ah! So many replays. Come on, Mick. Come on, Mick. Oh, no. Oh, it's so red. It's so obnoxiously red. Boom! Yes, he is. Uh oh. D D T. Oh, Kane blocks it, and man, did he make him pay! Oh uh, yes. All right. He's looking at it. Let's do this. Man. Oh there we go. Oh, I don't get to pin. One, two, what? Are you kidding me? After all the crap I've done to him, I put you through a table, Foley. I don't care how used to it you are. That's a KO moment. I hit you with steel steps. I tombstoned you. And now, <laughs> let's see if that gets it. <laughs> Aw, Kane's new finisher. The <laughs> okay, yes. Just keep bouncing off ropes while Mick Foley's standing. Superplex, 
Super heavyweights, ring collapse, here it comes. Oh. One, two, fuck. Come on, dude. It's the red. The red's screwing me up. It's giving him power. There you go. I cannot see anything. Like, this red plus the fact that my capture card makes the screen darker is killing me right now. I can do that too, man. <laughs> Bam. No, don't do that. There you go, Paul. I knew I could count on you, Paul. Let's go, Mick. I got a special place for you. In hell! Let's go. Choke slam from hell! Why does he never. Oh my god! Okay. Alright. Two. Three. Yes. Awesome. Awesome. It shouldn't have taken two tombstones, but, you know. Alright, you know what? That brings up a point that I have about this game. A recent complaint. Is up with the AI kicking out of everything? Is this just me? Or will you be able to go through a 20 minute, alright, maybe not that long, a 10 minute match with the AI, hit your signature, finisher, and all that good stuff, and they'll kick out, and you'll have to do it all again. Why? It's not even on epic, it's on normal. Why would they kick out like that? Oh, hey, we're starting to catch up with WCW. They're trailing my line. Road Dog and Billy Gunn versus the Road Warriors. I get to play as the New Age Outlaws. Yes. 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 And I get to beat up the Road Warriors. Sweet. Um, when Hawk is the legal tag partner, get his damage to moderate. Get Hawk to moderate and pin Animal as Billy Gunn. Okay, I don't know which one's which. Hawk to moderate, pin Animal. Oh, is this for the titles? <gasps> yes, it's for the titles! Oh my gosh. Alright, that's Animal, but in the middle of a match, I don't know if I'm going to be able to tell them apart. Alright, I'm not going to lie. That light thing is kind of cool. Look at that mullet. How do you expect me to pin that mullet? You better call somebody! Sorry. <laughs> okay. Why is the ass in Road Dog's theme censored? But you get to say I'm an ass man and show it all over the Titan Tron with Billy Gunn. Why? Why? 
That makes no sense. Like literally zero sense was made that day. Oh, I love the New Age Outlaws. Oh, I love the New Age Outlaws. Yay, I get to play as the New Age Outlaws. All right, never mind. I think I'll be able to take or uh, tell these hairdos apart. Look at that hair. Unbelievable. It's so unbelievable. I don't believe it. Attitude moments. These short cinematic sequences will appear suddenly to keep you on your toes. Look for quick mini games on the lower left corner of the screen when the moments present themselves. Well. He just turned him inside out. Okay. Uh, no, I didn't. Oh. Look at this hair. Unbelievable. This hair could win the Royal Rumble. Animal's hair for uh, Hall of Fame 2013. Holy crap. This is going to be the tagline of the episode. Freaking. What, what, what should it be? Animal's hair. An I don't know. Animal's hair cures cancer. This is. Look at this. How am I supposed to beat this hair? This mullet could could put Morgan Freeman out of a job. This hair could voice over those documentaries about penguins and all that crap. This is this is awesome. I don't even I don't even want to beat him up, but I do because I don't like the Road Warriors, and it's not because. You know, I think they're bad or anything. It's because all my life I've heard how every tag team in the world is incomparable to these freaking road warriors. Because my dad thinks they were the best thing since freaking sliced bread. Or should I say the best thing since animal's haircut. Boom. Like, there are wrestlers with cool hair. Dolph Ziggler. Uh, Kane. <laughs> and Animal. That's it. All three of them. Oh. Bam. You heard him, Animal. We gotta make the tag. Let's go, Road Dog. Oh, yes. Oh, how I love you, Road Dog. And now he's back out onto the apron. Oh, you didn't know? Now that is a Your ass better call somebody. Oh, pile driver. And he hits the pile driver. Uh -oh. Road Dog may have it here. Yes, shimmy. That's as Booker T would say. Come on! Ready to strike. Road dog has it where he wants it. We still gotta get we still gotta get a hawk's damage to moderate. I'm just working on uh, animals so I can pin him when the time comes. Okay, why does why does Road Dog have that move? He's not a heavy guy. Especially compared to Animal. Really? <gasps> there you go. Tag out, please. Please. Thank you. Oh. Like. I can understand. 
putting someone in the game if they were either a major focus of what your roster is aiming for, in this case the Attitude Era, or partially also today's roster, or if they have a, a lot of appearances in your single player campaign, which would be this. But let's look, let's look at last year's game. Road Warriors showed up maybe three times. They were not worth putting in that game. There were so many other WCW people you could have put in that game. Why the Road Warriors? Why put them in this year's game? Just to have this match? That was a cool pin. That was a really cool pin. Oh, what is that? What is that? Succeed with all the uh, attitude moments. All right. Elbow. Oh, baby. This isn't what I'm supposed to do. That would have been the best time to win, though. Give me an attitude moment. Please? And there's a hard right hand. He hits the drop kick. Oh boy. You don't want to give Hawk time to recover. Billy taking advantage. Ouch. All right. I'm supposed to do these stupid attitude moments. Where are they? Quick tag there. Oh. Got it. Strike Hawk with the tag team title before the ref wakes up. Oh, no, 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 Oh man, this is cool! I'm rubbing butts with him. That's classy. Wee! Bang Master! Bang Master! Go for the pin! Go for the pin! Ooh, one, one, two, three! Yeah. Oh, what? Three! Yes! Yes! Ooh, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, D-Generation X proudly presents to you your new WWE Tag Team Champions of the World, the Road Dog Jesse James, the Badass Billy Gunn, the New Age Outlaws! Yes! I got really into that. <laughs> that was cool. That was fun. This is fun. And I unlocked two characters I'm never going to use. And a bonus match. How long have we been doing this? 47 minutes. Okay, let's end it there because that was a really high note to end it on. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to thank you for watching this edition of the Supla's WWE 13 Let's Play. As always, my name is Nono Akimbo. <coughs> and I'm dying. Um... Uh, if you enjoyed this, please subscribe to the Suplish channel right here on the Suplish Show. And if you enjoyed my commentary, please go check out my channel at youtube.com forward slash nonoakimbo. I hope you enjoyed this episode, and I will see you all next week.